Hello, this is Helper Gal, and this is a review. My review is for the Schwarzkopf's Got to Be Metallic's Teal Hair Dye. If you already have red in your hair, common sense would have it that if you add green to the red in your hair, you will end up with black. That common sense holds true for the Schwarzkopf's Got to Be Teal Metallic's got to be metallics, uh, teal hair dye. If there's any red at all in your hair, your hair will turn black, just as mine did. It is black. It has a few highlights. I added back in after I dyed it because it was so, so dark that I, I um, put some um, fashionista, uh, semi-permanent um, tangerine into it just so that it wouldn't be suck all uh, absorb all light and just be the darkest black you could possibly imagine. So any slight reddish highlights that it still has, I added those in after I dyed it the, the, the teal color, it which came out as black as black can be as far as hair dye goes. Um, uh, there's not a hint of teal. I just like the color teal. I wasn't thinking. I should have done purple or red i usually do red my hair naturally has red undertones and it's like a dark chestnut sort of color um and uh well i don't particularly i'm not particularly i don't think that this suits me my daughter's that's what my daughter says she says that black hair does not suit me and uh hopefully i'm gonna do things to try to get the it to wash out so it won't be just so so um dark but uh yes this is the Schwarzkopf um, got to be metallic teal permanent hair dye. There's not any teal at all, just very, very dark. Uh, it's shiny, and it's nice that it's shiny, but uh, I don't always think things through very well, and this is definitely not what I was going for. And, uh, well, uh, it is what it is. So that is my review. If you have any red in, in your hair at all, don't use it because your hair will turn out extremely dark. Uh, because red plus green equals black. <laughs> so, and I knew better. And I did it anyway. And this is what happened. Okay. That is all. Bye-bye.